but I've had this hair for about five weeks now and I do not have any plans of taking them down anytime soon because Hi guys, it's Chilekwa. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, you can show that you like it here by liking, subscribing, leaving a comment down below. And without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Today, I am going to be showing you how I maintain my braids or how I keep my scalp clean when I have braids on. Um, so I've had this hair for about five weeks now and I do not have any plans of taking them down anytime soon because I just don't have the time at the moment to be dealing with my hair. So I'm going to show you what I do to clean my scalp. I'm going to show you my scalp real quickly. And this is pretty much how I just keep it clean. So that's my scalp. As you can see, really filthy, really dirty. So that's my scalp. So it's actually really important to um, have your scalp clean because um, when you usually when I have braids on I usually put some products on my scalp to promote hair growth like oils and all that kind of stuff so um, it's very important that I wash my scalp or clean my scalp once in a while so that um, it still encourages my hair to grow my hair my scalp is clean because your scalp needs a healthy base in which to grow and healthy scalp is a clean scalp so make sure your scalp is always clean and braids tend to get a little smelly or whatever if you don't if your scalp is not clean you can see i'm scratching my hair so that means like it's quite itchy so yeah that's what i'm gonna do so i only have two things that i'll be using in this video um i have uh, my spray bottle in here there's about three tablespoons of apple cider vinegar and about five drops of tea tree oil because I like to go ham with tea tree oil that's just to give my scalp a nice fresh and clean smell so I'm just gonna spray my scalp with this mixture I'm not really wetting it but just making sure my scalp has some water I'm just gonna wrap that in like this alone is enough to clean your scalp but today I want to do a more thorough wash. I'm going to grab my Coco Wash Co-Wash Cleanser. And I'm just going to add like a small tiny bit amount of it. So this is like a conditioner that cleanses. So it just keeps your scalp cleansed at all times. I'm just going to take that and just put that on my scalp. All around. Don't use too much because um, I'm not going to drench my braids in water because i just feel like that makes them a little heavy and it then i'm just gonna grab the spray bottle again and just keep sprayed Yeah, as you can see, my scalp is now really, really wet. And now, like, most of the dirt that's on there can really come off. I'm gonna grab my towel. And then I'm just gonna pat the area, like so. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and do that on the other side, like so. Okay, let's check it out now. 
that is a much cleaner scalp I can look at that it looks fresher it looks cleaner that I can totally work with I can work with it for about two weeks or so before I take them down finally I then grab my spray bottle and then I'm just gonna spritz the ends of my hair just to re-moisturize the braids with the same mixture what I love about it is it's gonna sort of revive the hair and also make it smell better <laughs> give it a better smell this is completely optional but once I'm done this is what I do I grab this can to grow strong hair treatment and then I just grab like this much like just a tiny amount of it I think this just restores the strength to your strands but I take it and I add it to the lengths of my hair like so and I sort of just press it in so that it goes in and I've noticed whenever I use this it gives my braids some sort of shine so I like that once I've done that I will then part my, my braids that is to where I normally like to part them and I'm pretty happy with how my scalp is looking so then I'll just take it like that then I'll take my satin scarf and then I will wrap it on my head and what that does is all these flower fly away hairs and the hairs that are standing up will lie flat so I'll just take that and I will tie it like so so I'll tie it like so on my hair make sure it's nice and secure and I'll usually like sleep like that but I'll, I'll, I'll normally throw a bonnet on it so I usually just roll up my hair up roll up my hair like that put it into a bonnet and then go to sleep and then the next day I'll take it off and it'll look good as new out thank you guys so much for watching this video please don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below and I will see you in my next video bye tomorrow